the U.S. Navy is back in the Barents Sea for the first time since the Cold War. Three American destroyers, a combat support ship and a British Royal Navy frigate have entered the waters north of Scandinavia and Russia to conduct joint security operations, the Navy announced Monday. In these challenging times, it is more important than ever that we maintain our steady drumbeat of operations across the European theater, while taking prudent measures to protect the health of our force, said Vice Admiral Lisa Franchetti, commander of the U.S. Sixth Fleet. Navy hospital ships in coronavirus fight saw few patients despite large capacities. We remain committed to promoting regional security and stability, while building trust and reinforcing a foundation of Arctic readiness, she added. The exercises have been taking place in areas with temperatures as low as minus 14 degrees Fahrenheit. Click here to get the Fox News app. According to the Navy, the last time its fleet operated in the Barents Sea was in the mid-1980s. Russia's Ministry of Defense was informed on May 1 of the Navy's plans for the USS Donald Cook, USS Porter, USS Roosevelt, USNS Supply and Royal Navy HMS Kent. The notification was made in an effort to avoid misperceptions, reduce risk, and prevent inadvertent escalation, according to the Navy.